Hi, everybody. Uh, okay, so yeah, a couple weeks ago when we were talking about MCP, we were talking about like installing something on your local laptop, and it was super cool, but it didn't let you, you know, it didn't integrate with the web, it didn't work on your phone. Authentication was really weird, you know, it typically involved like whispering softly into the chat interface with your uh, API keys. And so um, it's come a long ways. Like now we have remote MCP servers that let MCP work everywhere. And the MCP auth spec, like Michael was saying, has like, you know, introduced more normal auth flows where your uh, MCP server is the resource server, auth kits your authorization server, and the MCP client is doing all the uh, OAuth client work. Um, so we thought it'd be really cool, like everyone here has an app, not everyone has built MCP into it yet, so we thought we'd take like an off the shelf app and just add MCP to it, which is like pretty low drama these days. Um, so we have just like a, we grabbed a next commerce kind of template, uh, and we threw it up on MCP shop. This has gotten smaller. Um, we threw it up on mcp.shop. Uh, so please take a look. Um, we, the, the modifications we made here is we added AuthKit for sign-in. Um, we shrunk it down to just a single product because uh, that's all we sell. And then we replaced the web checkout with um, this order with AI button. And it teaches how to uh, add MCP shop as an MCC, MCP server to your favorite chat client. So like we've got um, Claude integration instructions. They support remote MCP servers right now. Or if your favorite client doesn't yet, we've got instructions for using MCP remote. So that'll work with like Goose, Cursor, Zed, what, what have you. Um, okay, I wanna look at like actual code here. So we have added um, an MCP route to our next app. And it's, it's pretty lightweight. We pulled in like the normal library code for getting orders and products. Uh, we have this with AuthKit wrapper to provide authentication. And then we're using Vercel's new MCP adapter. I think they're gonna demo it, so I'm not gonna talk too much about it. Um, but basically we, get a server, this is like a model context protocol server object from the TypeScript SDK. We wrap it in with AuthKit, and that's gonna give us this auth context. That'll have like the user that signed in, uh, access token, claims, all that kind of stuff. And then we just define tools on the server. So we, we have one to list the inventory. Uh, it, basically any tool, same process. You give it a name, you give it a big long description. Better descriptions work better with LLMs as you all know. And, and then we return some content. So in this case, we are able to share our like web part of the code with our MCP server. Uh, I've got another tool to buy the items. Um, and again, it's just calling my regular place order function. I'm passing a user that I get from AuthKit. And there's one final tool to list the orders that have been placed. Again, it's authenticated. That's really important so that you can't see like other people's orders. Um, let's try it. Uh, so I've got Claude here. I've already added mcp.shop as an integration. This is a step you would have to do. Um, but basically when you add a remote server to your favorite chat client, it will go out and do like an OAuth dynamic registration with your authentication service. So AuthKit in this case. Um, and then the user still needs to connect. That's the login process. Um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that now. Connect will take me to AuthKit. Looks great. I'm gonna continue with Google. And I will give Claude access to my account. Okay, hey, I hear WorkOS is giving out sweet MCP t-shirts. This delay feels really long up here. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, okay, okay, we're checking the inventory. Great, there is one product available. Okay, would you like me to order it? Heck yeah, I would. Okay, so we're gonna give it some info. Large, work OS, 
one, two, three, MCP Street, SFCA. All right, we're going to buy it. Thank goodness. And just attempt fate one more time. We'll, we'll exercise that last tool. Hmm, are you sure that order went through? All right, so um, MCP, actually really easy to add to your app. Uh, please, everyone, integrate with our little mcp.shop and get yourself a t-shirt, and then come talk to us about using Authkit in your app. Uh, back to you, MG. Awesome.